Hey YouTube, this is Mr. DBG33K and today I'm gonna present to you um, the three released uh, Dragon Boxes that Funimation has released uh, so far. Um, there will be seven in all for the for the series of Dragon Ball Z and currently like I said there's only three out and I'm gonna show, you, show them to you one by one um, showing the artwork of the cases of the boxes themselves um, right now you're looking at the um, the spine artwork um, when it's completed it's gonna have Goku and Gohan in little action poses as you, you can see clearly uh, for Goku right now um, starting with the fourth box you'll start to see I think it's gonna finish off uh, Goku's body and start to see some of Gohan's face I do believe um, box 4 comes out September 14th 2010 Okay, let's start with the first box. First box has Goku on the front. That's the dragon box right there. There's Goku on the front in his action pose. Yes, it is the same action pose that will be on the spine when it's completed. Um, so that's the front of the box. The binding looks like so. It has a one-star Dragon Ball, episodes 1 through 42. And then at the top there it says Dragon Box Z, volume 1. Okay, so starting with the discs, the first disc case has three discs, or every disc case has three discs, it's good to, good to mention. Um, you have, first disc is going to have Goku on it, second disc has Piccolo, third disc has Gohan. Each disc contains seven episodes, and we'll continue to do that throughout the entire uh, Dragon Box release until I think the last box, which may be numbered differently as far as the, the episodes per disc. I'm not totally sure on that one though. Okay, the second. Oh, also to mention, I should have shown it on the first one. Uh, you get a good little picture of Shenron on uh, one side of each of the disc cases. Picture of Shenron and then that, which says, you know, Dragon Ball Z Volume 1 DVD box. Should have been this way. Is it? Not. I don't know, I can't tell right now with my camera. I currently have the um, you know, the LCD screen pointed towards me. I can't tell if it's inverted or just backwards and wrong. Nope, this is it. Sorry guys, that's it. Okay, and then um, the discs in this one has a Kai Osama on this one, or King Kai, um, Nappa, and Vegeta. Um, the first set goes episodes 1 through 42, ending with... Um, I believe uh, right in the middle of the Namek filler, the fake Namek filler. Okay, this is the Dragon Book. One side is has Goku on the front, different action pose for Goku. And then the actual cover of the Dragon Book has Vegeta on it in his um, Namek armor. Well, I guess it could be the other armor. It could be his uh, Saiyan Saga uh, armor. Uh, you can't really see the, the bottom parts of it where it would come out if it were his uh, Saiyan armor. From what you can see it looks like it could be either. Okay, so starting on the actual book, there's a picture of Shenron, Dragon Book, another picture of Goku, little, uh, you know, thing telling you all the stuff that's in the book. I'll just show you all that. That's all that's in there. Another picture of Goku. Um, then the first, uh, the first little section we have in here is called uh, the early days. And this is basically summing up different parts of Dragon Ball, the original Dragon Ball, and what happened, uh, what happened during that time for Goku. And that happens for a few pages. Um, a few pages, a few pages. Then you go into the the profiles of. Uh, it's actually called the profile of Goku family. Um, so that has Kid Gohan, Krillin, Goku, and Piccolo. I don't know when Piccolo became the family of Goku, but you know, that's alright. Um, interesting to note, or great to note, is that this is taken directly from the Japanese Dragon Books. Um, so these are, like, for sure directly translated from those same, lots of the same artwork and the same kind of graphics, like this is this timeline. Um, actually, a, a character reference kind of character relationship chart. Excuse me. Um, 
is taken almost verbatim from uh, the Japanese uh, translation. So, a little uh, relationship chart for the characters, how they're all connected to Goku. Um, you know, all that stuff going on. Hold on, get some pages flipped. Episode guide. Each, um, or perfect guide is what this is called, but it basically tells you what saga you're currently in or what the uh, set goes through. This one, like I said, goes through Saiyan Saga through uh, part of the fake Namek filler. Um, not quite to the guinea right there. Um, 1 through 42. Let's see. Then you get started on the actual episode... Um, episode summaries, which are, again, taken directly from the Dragon Boxes, from the, the R2 uh, Japanese releases. Interesting, interesting, interesting. Uh, yep, episodes, episodes, episodes. Make sure I'm not missing any important little features or anything. Nope. Sorry about that, guys. Hold on. There you go. Uh, this is something else. This is uh, there's a timeline on this side. It's like everything that ha was happening at this time, I guess, in the world, as well as the the Dragon Ball universe, kind of putting those on the same timeline. Um, yeah, you can probably read those. Um, I can't read it right now because I'm not looking at it. So, yeah, pretty interesting that they would have that. I think it's kind of funny. Um, then on this side, oh, kind of like little summaries, images, stuff, um, to, corresponding to the ones, um, marked on that actual timeline. So then more episode stuff, more episode stuff, episode stuff. Yep. And then fashion check. Oh, this is kind of interesting. Um, different kinds of clothes that you see the characters wearing that they don't usually wear. For instance, um, Yamcha in his baseball suit, lols, um, Bulma in her space suit, Gohan wearing his little nerd fest right there, and um, let's see Bulma wearing a pink dress. I don't even remember when she wore that. It must have been a flashback or something. And then Bulma in her in her in her uh, undies. That's always wonderful to see. Um, so, yeah. Okay. So. I think that's about it for the first Dragon Book. Ooh, this is like the greatest part. Um, these are the Design Works collection, and basically um, design art before characters were completely, you know, finished with their designs. Um, very interesting. Some of these aren't even found in the Daizenshu. Um, some of them can only be found in the Dragon Books. Um, that's very interesting. That especially since the Daizenshu are no longer available, published. The fact that we can get a hold of these through um, these releases, the Dragon Box US releases, is awesome. And those will continue to be there um, throughout the next Dragon Books as well. Or the next Dragon Boxes in their books as well. There's a couple more from the Saiyan stuff going on there. Raditz, Cyberman, Vegeta, Nappa. A little bit of less important characters. And Kaiosama, King Yama. Oops. Popo, Kami, Gregory and Bubbles. Walls. Uh, so yeah, that is the end of Dragon Book for Dragon Box Volume 1. I wonder how long we're doing on time. Oh, already eight minutes. Okay, I'm thinking I'm gonna split this up then into the into three different groups. Um, that way we can get them all done and have I don't know, actually be able to publish it on YouTube since they can only do up to ten minutes nowadays. Um, so you can expect more videos. I think I might be able to get the uh, second two boxes into one ten minute video um, since I'm not going to be going into the aesthetics of the boxes themselves as much um, nor the timeline, not timeline, um, you know episode summaries uh, as heavily. We'll see. Um, thanks for watching. Hope you tune into the next episodes. See ya.